A question of character. Colonel William F. Guile is an international war hero. Flash kick. Colonel William F. Guile not only dedicates his heroism to his country, he dedicates it to the world. Colonel William F. Guile is a colonel within the Allied Nations Army. They are true. They are blue. The Allied Nations Army are dressed in water war camouflage. Become the sea. Colonel William F. Guile has a devious rival, the richest and strongest drug dealer of all time, General M. Bison. General M. Bison is passionate about drugs, live newscast of his own atrocity, evil theme parks, and the color red. General M. Bison has taken hostages to barter for a $20 billion exchange, keeping them in the worst of conditions. Dry biscuits, steel mesh beds, no mattress. Colonel William F. Guile will do battle with General M. Bison within Shadowloo, a beautiful South Asian jungle with elephants. Elephants do not scare Colonel William F. Guile. Nothing scares Colonel William F. Guile. These triangles are the allied nation. This triangle is Colonel William F. Guile. Bravery. Colonel William F. Guile expects only the best from his soldiers and his right-hand comrades. T-Hawk, Band-Aid Man, and Cammy, Lady of Kick. Colonel William F. Guile is a master of the quip. Guile is the most quick-witted soldier to ever exist. When Sagat threatens him, he states, I'm the repo man and you're out of business. Quip, anger him and he will call you a big head. Become his voyeur and you will be subject to one of the most vulgar and offensive muscle gestures ever broadcast. Oh, flash kick. Colonel William F. Guile is an amazing martial artist. Mere intimidation will cause assassins to wait and turn for his strike. His body is that of a powerhouse. Colonel William F. Guile can perform incredible feats of acrobatics, outstanding jump kicks, defying the physics of man. Launch. Colonel William F. Guile is a discerning man. He may consort with criminals if necessary such as Ken Masters and Ryu Hoshi, master of the sharpened blade and lowly gun running partner to Ken. Men barely desirable of throat mucus. Colonel William F. Guile will turn them from their P for prisoner attire to H for heroes. Of course, only after an excellent quip. Colonel William F. Guile has real friends, like Charlie, who was unfortunately completely outed when captured by General M. Bison after Colonel William F. Guile promises his rescue. Charlie immediately realizes the mistake. Therefore, Colonel William F. Guile's best friend becomes more captured, and they feed him war stuff by Dr. Dalsey, tinted in psychotic orange, as well as anabolic plasma and DNA mutagens. The mutagens change his skin to delicious lemon lime, while the anabolic plasma colors Charlie's hair. Fortunately, Dr. Dalsey will try to help Guile's dear friend by feeding him nice stuff, dolphins, marriages, and the Reverend Martin Luther King Jr. He will come out a confused mess. Colonel William F. Guile deals with mutated comrades in only one way, and that is to shoot them in the face. Sometimes Colonel William F. Guile must be dissuaded. Lastly, Guile is an expert planner of missions, and during his briefings, he never misses time for an excellent quip. Captain Sawada states that anyone looking to execute infiltration missions to pilot a warboat by themselves must be in Say, Guile retorts that luckily Bison has driven him crazy, thereby admitting to his soldiers that he is insane. They will still follow his trusted command, and Guile will commit to piloting the incredible XRB1 stealth boat alone, but with other people. On the other hand, don't ask Guile if he has lost his mind because he will tell you that you have lost your balls. You've just been quipped. Take my boat, Fartwater. The Allied Nations Army is equipped with the finest of technology, but only one XRB superboat. The rest of the army gets regular boats. The XRB-1 uses radar broadcast by satellites that display Bison radar net. The army gets inflatable assault craft. The XRB-1 is equipped with the latest in stealth 
health technology that requires a safety visor and hurts. It also has a video cassette player for times of sentimental nostalgia. I remember the times of Charlie. Finally, the XRB1 allows for televideo communications upon any frequency, which is perfect for quips. As Colonel William F. Giles states, this is the collection agency, Bison. Your ass is six months overdue, and it's mine. Excellent quip. Bison never realized his ass debts. Colonel William F. Guile, a hero that is unconcerned about people's safety during raids and more concerned about justice and quips. He is also a man unafraid of playing dead for hours. Reanimate or ogling a female comrade and quipping about how he's going to tear it up. Colonel William F. Guile ignores flies during motivational speeches. Pose. Next episode, even ninjas have telephones. Quest with me. Learn with us. Enrich your mind. Empower your anchor. Like our material. Subscribe to our page. Put character into quest. Return every Monday for more. A question of character. They are true. They are blue.